Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're back with another player review. I said I would do this, so now I'm doing it. Today we're looking at Sapphire Giannis Atentecupo. I can never say his last name. One thing that irks me about his card already is, is the fact that he's not a point guard. I really wish that he was a point guard because he has some amazing stats to be a point guard. His passing is just... Is just great. His mid range got upgraded a lot, and his shot close is now a 90, and his open mid range is an 87 because obviously his card got upgraded, got upgraded two tiers, and he's not a point guard. I like to have my small forwards to be able to shoot the three, and Giannis is known not to shoot the three in 2K, so that was. The first thing that I didn't really like about the card, that he's not a point guard. Because also he has 90 speed. So he would just create mismatches all around the court with a point guard. So that's just my little gripe with this card. Apart from that, he's a, pre he's a pretty fun card to use. I didn't really have high expectation of him. Because when I play small forwards, I like them to shoot the three. If they don't shoot the three, then my expectation of them goes down a little bit. I try not to let it, but it's just when he's open for the three, it's really annoying that I tr that I can't shoot with him that well, seeing as he only has a 73 ball. One thing I do like is his badges that he's got given. He has Lob City Finisher, Posterizer, and Relentless Finisher. Now, one thing I found with the card is when I used him that he didn't slam the ball like as much as you would want him. Like, if you look at Steve Francis' Amethyst card, no matter how who's in front of him when you drive, he will dunk the ball. With Giannis, who's six foot eleven, he doesn't really dunk the ball that much. He, as much as his tendency says is a fifty, he doesn't dunk the ball that well. So, one thing I do like is with him being six foot eleven, he does grab a lot of rebounds, which is one thing I really like. His free throw got up upgraded as well, so he is very good at taking free throws. It is a 78, so you can easily get by with it. His block also got upgraded, as well as his steal. One thing I would say is, if you're going to get this card, is play him at point guard. That is one thing I would say is just play him at point guard. I wouldn't really put him at the small forward. I'd play him at point guard because 2K doesn't really seem to decrease the player's ability for where they play. So... Playing at a point guard, being six foot eleven, you should be okay. So yeah, that's basically what I give the card: seven enjoyment, seven expectation, because it wasn't really set. The price you can get him for forty five k or something like that. So he's very expensive. If you if you like to shoot the mid range and drive a lot, this card will be good for you. And if you rarely take a three, this card will be good for you. So I give the overall an 8 because he's good at what he does, like which is driving and dishing the ball. But apart from that, it's 3 really lets him down. It is still a 70, so you could get by with it, but it's still not that good. So, hey guys, that's it for my review of Giannis. Let me know who you want me to review next, and I will try and get around to it. See you guys later. Take care. Peace.